Greetings, I am Cross Knights, Kicker of Asses. Kicking downs of the names that I spell and pronounce incorrectly. But hey, that's just me. The last episode, uh, Jafar was all like, Genie, go and stab those guys. And he was like, I guess I will, but half-heartedly, so I was still able to defeat Jafar. Ha, 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 ha. Um, I... I've done a practice run of the boss, so hopefully it won't go terribly wrong like some of the other ones. I also realized how to get that chest up there. Um, I didn't really notice, but there's actually two monkeys you can activate. I need a lad himself, of course I do. Of course I do! He's got Babu! A Babu! The monkey that can sort of talk, but not really. Babu! Woohoo! Alright. And we have... Dalmatians! So I found two treasure chests of Dalmatians in Agrabah. Let's check Dalmatian. Oh, good thing I checked, because I almost forgot. Let's see, Agrabah, there's two more chests. Yeah, there's, there's a lot I gotta do. Um... Yes, characters. I've been negligent at showing new characters. I already, I already showed him, so let's say. Um, I've already showed all you guys. So Aladdin! Dun, da, da, da. Aladdin's one of my favorite Disney movies as a kid. I watched it quite a bit. It was pretty awesome. And as I mentioned, the, uh, the computer-generated parts were just amazing looking back then. But now everything's computer-generated, so whatever. I think that's... I always, I always do Jiminy Cricket, because he's always at the damn end. Um, I swear there's people here that I've missed. Oh, well. Too bad. 99 puppies. Oh, I'm watching a show called, um, I believe it's called Once Upon a Time. And in that, like, all the characters in it are actually, like, um, storybook characters, but they don't know it. And, um, this guy has a Dalmatian, and you find out the Dalmatian's name is Pongo, so that's pretty cool. Because <laughs> even 100 Dalmatians, or 99 Dalmatians, or how many Dalmatians are there? 101 Dalmatians. Even they, uh, even they are in the story, kind of. <laughs> I doubt that there's, you know, actually 99 of them, but it's cool that they put that in there. So then, Lamp Chamber. Jafar's final wish was to be turned into an all-powerful genie. And the genie had to accept, because Jafar had the lamp. Let's give you... do I even have potions? I'll give them both to Aladdin, because Donald's just gonna freaking quack and die. Did I just... whatever. You're not getting that other potion, Aladdin. You don't deserves it. Alright. Onward! Onward and downward. The lamp! Get your far's lamp! Is it not here, is it just me? That is totally Gilbert Godfrey. Um so yes, in this on this boss battle, you can't hit Jafar. He's a genie, he is immortal. Blood of kings and all of that. You can hit his lamp, however. And Iago will fly around like a jerk, trying to keep it away from you. He looks like he's stuck in the wall though. He's kind of wedged between the wall and the, the brazier. This is what happened when I practiced also. But I remember in my initial playthrough, uh, this fight was really annoying. Iago just kept on flying to places that I couldn't reach. But yeah, this one's... <laughs> I just did so much damage to the lamp there, I think I'm good. I sense a fireball being thrown at me. Oh yeah, and also the, the floor like changes like up and down, so... That's also annoying. Oh, nice try, Aladdin. But yeah, I gotta get up there. Dodge! Ow! <laughs> that was a bad dodge, if I've ever seen one. wonder if Simba could reach him. I don't really feel like trying, though. He's on the ground here, though. I can really clobber away at him. 
Well, yeah, this fight's either really easy or really annoying and still easy. <laughs> Can I hit him with lightning? Nope. I guess it makes sense that the lamp would be resistant to magic. And Yagyu would be resistant to everything, because he'd be all like, rah, rah, rah. Even Jafar, you know, he's not doing a very good job just, like, slowly chucking fireballs. He should be turning us into rutabagas. It's very hard to fight when you're a rutabaga. I know this from personal experience. You're not even tasty. I mean, that's kind of a good thing, because no one eats you. But... Still, you gonna come out platform? There we go. There we go, platform. Let's all play together. Be nice. Ha! Ah! Only two attacks. Shame. Pity. Okay. Where you are? There you are. When you wish upon a star, be careful you don't get hit by a car. Don't wish on stars in the middle of the road, is what I'm saying. Very nice, Donald. So now I'm, like, completely sure that Donald only gets the same spells that you get. Because as soon as I got that arrow spell, he started, uh, started using it. And that's why I like to have Donald on, uh, like, use supportive magic. Don't... Ah, oh, target in Jafar. Uh, because that wind spell, it really, it's a lifesaver. The wind spell is great. I mean, it even helps you, like, heal and use potions better, because if you're using, uh, heal and someone hits you, you will stop using heal, and if they hit you again, you might die. But if you have the wind spell and they hit you, you're still gonna use heal. So there we go, jackpot and maximum MP up. Victory slash! Sweet. <laughs> Almost forgot. That would have been terrible. El Terrible. Okay, Jafar. Back to your lamp. That's why you should have asked to become an all-powerful sorcerer instead of an all-powerful genie. Oversight on your part. Obtain the power of foyer. Fire is upgraded to fire. Obtained Ansem's report number one. Excellent. Uh-oh. Trouble! Jasmine? Jasmine! Lock. Stock. Two smoking barrels! And then lock again. Yeah, good luck ever finding that thing again. Getting the hell out of here. Whack. Whack. I'm not even sure. I don't think it's possible to die at this point. You could probably just, uh, automatic gummy ship it, but it's, it's a pretty cool addition. Ah, I could just... Ah. If you time it right, you can knock those rocks out of the way. It's better to just dodge them, but whatever. Woo! And I don't think the stalactites and stalagmites can ever hurt you. Yeah. <laughs> you just bounce off. Up we go! Also, you can spin because it's cool. Do uh, dodge. Ow. Dodge. Too fast for you. Huh. Weird that they would have magic restorative here. It's not like I can start chucking fireballs or anything.
I'm hoping I can get back there despite the fact that the entrance collapses, because uh, I doubt I found everything. But I'm almost completely sure much later you can go back in. I mean, if there is puppy still in there, that'd be terrible. I'd have to, like, play the whole game again to get the special ending. So Jasmine's no longer in Agrabah. Sora, let's go find her. Sorry, I can't take you with me. Why not? I sure wish we could. But we can't. If we take him to another world, that would be... Mud... Mud... Muddling! Aladdin, we'll find Jasmine, I promise. Uh, Earth to Al? Hello, you still have one wish left? Look, just say the word. Ask me to find Jasmine for you. I... I wish for your freedom, Genie. Al! A deal's a deal, Genie. Now, you can go anywhere you want. You're your own master. But, if you can, it'd be great if you could go along with them and help Sora find Jasmine. Hmm... Sorry, Al. I'm done taking orders from others. But... A favor? Now that's entirely different. I guess I could give that a try. After all, we're pals, right, Al? Genie. Just leave it to me! <laughs> ah. <laughs> that smarmy Bazir could have had him. If someone had stuck around to give him a hand... Hey, I did my part. I brought the princess, didn't I? Jafar was beyond help, consumed by his own hatred. One should be aware of letting it burn too fiercely. Whoa, whoa, lighten up. I'm as cool as they come, okay? By the way, kid, have we got something special for you? Huh? We had a deal, yes. You help us, and we grant you your wish. Kairi! Go to her. Your vessel is waiting. Just remember, this is no pleasure cruise. It won't be a pleasant voyage. Why are you doing all this for me? What's the catch? Catch? What's the catch? Silly boy. You're like a son to me. I only want you to be happy. I seriously doubt that. Believe what you wish. But lest we forget, I kept my end of the bargain. I just can't take Captain Hook seriously as a villain. <laughs> He's too goofy in everything that he does. Learned the summon spell, Genie. He's a pretty good summon, too. Oh, jeez. Um, ignore what just happened, because it's going to happen again. All right, good. <laughs> I hope I did not just screw up this recording. Uh, so, yes, I also got a new keychain, finally. Sora, please find Jasmine for me. Will do. Um, did I learn the Green Trinity, too? I think I did, but... <laughs> It might have been distorted by the fact that I was trying an experiment. Yes, I learned Ladder Trinity. Very cool. So there is... Anywhere there's a green Trinity, I can unlock them now. I do remember where one of them is immediately. Let's equip the three wishes. As I've had this Jungle King for a long time. So, what is it? The Jungle King... Uh, longer Reach. That's what its special power is. This says, uh, harder to block. And it has more magical power. Ooh, Goofy has another item slot. 
Let's give you the brave warrior. Now, what is the ray of light? Ooh. That's really cool. What if we... Oh, and it increases your MP. That's very cool. Um... How much does that increase the defense? By three. Ugh. And this is by two. So... Ah, let's give him the Ray of Light. We want him to have stronger magical power. Abilities. I have two AP left. Jackpot. Um... I'm actually gonna go with Counter-Attack. It's about time I had that. And I finally have enough AP for it. Okay, never mind. I, I was gonna, like, unequip dodge roll and be like, I don't need you, Ability Stud, but it increases my AP by two, not one. So it's actually a better item than I had thought it was. So, uh, I need to find that door with the other save, because that has a green trinity. And there are no more Heartless in town. I can just walk around. Um, I think there's actually people. Like, there's, like, two or three characters just standing around the town, too. Not that they say anything interesting or give you anything, but they're there. Ah, oh, there's one. Travelers used to throng Agrabah's streets, but now those shadows have overrun the city. Yeah. That sucks for us. Let's go! Trinity Ladder! Uh. Goofy is a lanky bastard. I never noticed this before. Power up. Excellent. Definitely want that. Give me some dead. I need power. Power! Power! So I can... Yeah, I don't really feel like exploring the streets of Agrabah anymore. Why do I roll the R there? Because it's fun. Alright, so we can visit more places now that Trinities have been unsealed. So it's basically pointing me, go back to Traverse Town because I can unlock the, uh, Synthification Shop. Ah, uh, and I'm also mentioning the book, which I still don't know if I'm going to show it in normal episodes because it's these, like, asinine little mini-games that aren't fun. But I should show it somewhere for completeness sake. The real question is, do I show this for completeness sake? Thinking maybe... I, I'm thinking yes. I'm thinking I should probably show the tournament. Maybe I should just do a tournament real fast and then end the episode? You guys okay with that? If not, sorry. I said this days in the past. So again, build a time machine, tell me if you want to stop me. Though if you build a time machine, I suggest doing something more important than directing someone's LPs. Like, um... I don't know, killing Hitler's kind of cliche, so... Um... Ooh, bank robbery! That, no. That wouldn't work. Unless you went farther back into the past. Whatever, if you're smart enough to build a time machine, you probably have a good idea. I can't think of anything good offhand right now. The Trinity Ladder has knocked down a ladder. It's clandestine or something. Let's climb up the ladder. Aha! And it's already been staffed and with uh, Moogles. They move quickly, they do. So... Ooh, are those treasure chests actually? Yeah, I can open them up. Thank you, Robin, your shop in front of you. Puppies! You guys have had these puppies here all along. Shame on you. So basically, if you find the required items, you can unlock all of these cool things. Note there's only six things that can be created, but there'll be more unlocked later on. So, and you can get the ultimate weapon through sensification. In order to do that, you need to sensitize everything that it is possible to sensitize. Since, since, since pressure, remember. All of these things, all these shards are dropped by enemies randomly. Um, so I'm gonna just try to build as many as I can, because I'm gonna need to build them all eventually. So I need two frost shards in order to build an elixir. Now, if you need a specific type of shard, there are FAQs, so you can find out which enemies drop them, and then you just, you know, while you're leveling up, you can also look for items. If you have lucky strike, like I do, because I'm a lucky devil, then, uh, it's easier. Hello. Ooh, postcard. Excellent. I forgot that I'm supposed to be looking for those. Eventually, I will get all of them, and then get the prize, which I don't know what it is. 
If you know, don't tell me. I want to be surprised. I only found eight last playthrough. And people keep on telling me things that I miss, and I'm realizing, uh, as far as a long game, I have not played this game much. I've only played... This is the third time I've ever played this game. So it's not like Chrono Trigger, where, like, I find pretty much everything in the game except I stupidly miss Mangus' ultimate weapon. But i played it so many times, I didn't need to brush up on an FAQ. But if I wanted to find most of the stuff here, <laughs> I would need to do some serious FAQ reading. So yeah, I think instead of starting a new world, I'm probably going to go back and fight in that new, uh, new challenge ring. Chaos. You don't really have anything I need, sir. Can I sell anything I don't want, though? I could sell... Oh, pretty stones. Completely useless. Power chain. That seems kind of dumb. Whatever, I'll keep it. Um, this guy... I swear I've seen him once before. What? You've seen me before? Perhaps you're thinking of someone else? The place where I think I've seen him is, like, I think he's the one that loses his heart at the beginning. Like, he's the first one to, like, be turned into a heartless uh, in this world. But it's possible that that's just due to not rotating your character models as much as you should. I don't know. But let's go back to the Olympiad Callus Cream Pie. Olympus Coliseum. There we... Yeah. Yeah. Are you going to compete? It'd be really great to face you. Yeah, let's do this. I'm doing this now because you get a, a spell. And even though it's a spell that I will probably never use except for perhaps creating variety, um, it, it'd be good to do, yeah. So yeah, I'll fight in the competition and then I'll end the episode. This shouldn't be too hard at all. Not at all. Wait, I didn't give myself potions. Um, excuse me, I'm going to start that again and give myself potions. Yeah, that was huge oversight. Also, I should have bought potions. That also would have been good. Oh, wow, I'm at, uh, that, that's great. Well, hopefully everything will go excellently, because I think I'm at sufficient level that I'm just going to tear through them, and I don't think there's any crazy end boss to this competition. It's the first of the uh, random optional arenas that you can do. So, nothing too big should happen. Stop blinking. Blinking is for humans, not for recording setups. Words to live by. Oh yeah, and I have Blizzard! Uh, wow. <laughs> I think I'll be fine this competition. I just have a feeling. You. I might start it out cutting the vic cutting out the victory screens because they're gonna get repetitive, and it'll go faster. Let's see. Blast! Holy crap, man! <laughs> I am liking this Blizzard spell for this competition. Yeah, I've <laughs> if I wanted to make like a fight out of it, I should have done this earlier because I'm gonna tear through these guys. Okay. I probably left that victory screen in, though, because I don't know if the victory screens have been seen yet. But eventually, they're going to get very repetitive. You. Uh, I like that I'm actually doing some decent damage now. So if you notice, these are the feet of the boss that uh, you fight in Traverse Town. I just have to fight part of the boss now. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Got it in before the group jury screen. Hop, 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 hop. And... Shotgun! Stay right there, guys. You should not have stayed right there. I just destroyed your bodies. I got all but three of them in one blast. <laughs> Love it. I believe the, like, Blizzra... Well, that was not aiming in the direction that I could see. No, I don't know if it fires more snowflakes, so I don't know if it hits more targets, but it's definitely more powerful. Huh. <laughs> it's a freaking lamp hanging off the edge of my uh, thing. Now, I can't show you the genie summon, because one of the rules for um, Colosseum battling is that you can't use, use summons. It specifically says that in the rules. 
Doing so much damage. Oh, I think he blocked me. What a jerk. Let me see here. That was a counter attack. If I block them and I hit attack, I can do a counter attack immediately afterwards. It'll happen automatically if I parry attacks. Hooray! Yeah, parrying an attack and blocking attack, I believe, are the exact same thing, except that parrying is much harder. And I generally only do it by accident as opposed to on purpose. I'm still using ice. <laughs> Even though I couldn't kill those guys. I do have uh, the new fire, but, you know, it's not all that impressive. I'm out of MP. Well, I didn't even need potions for this. You guys are just going to keep on flying around me like jerks, aren't you? Excellent. Tore through you. Pradeshi? That is not a word that I am familiar with. Must be in duck language. Two large bodies. Not a problem for the Keyblade Master, especially because they start out asleep. Oh, so much damage. <laughs> Probably only take two and a half full combos to destroy them now. Blocked. Uh, tried to block a shockwave. The way you block shockwaves is by dodging them. Yes. Can't hit me. Can't hit me. Can't hit, can't hit, can't hit me. Ow, you hit me. That parry was way too soon. It's because I was making up a mocking jingle instead of concentrating. Oh, hello. I thought we were done. Sorry that I did not get to you in a timely fashion, sir. Well, I cut that victory screen out because it was exactly the same as the last one. The Noiv. Have some variety, Donald. So now I'm fighting, uh, like, half the boss. I think I'm fighting everything but the torso. Uh... Cured. Inciting rebellion. Whoa. <laughs> you just got a preview of Goofy's tornado attack. I'm guessing he kind of got better at it in the second game or something, because he spins for such a long time it's ridiculous. Three times in a row, Donald! Man, come up with something new. All right, this is the final battle. I'm finally fighting the torso, it seems. Lightning! No. <laughs> no magic. Ice probably would have been better there anyway. I could have taken out all the lightning guys. Bam! Torso defeated. This competition is over. The rest is just formalities. Get him, Goofy! Hells yeah! Donald, if you say Predation, I'm going to punch you. Take that. Excellent. <laughs> what do I get? Candy? I hope it's candy. We're the champs. I get confetti! I prefer candy. Delicious chocolate candy. Obtain the power of the stars. Learn spell gravity. Also known as Demi for old school Final Fantasy events. I never thought you'd do it. Not bad. Phil, you're just as stubborn as ever. Don't pretend you are not happy for them. Heh. <laughs> now, kid, you still got a long way to go. The next round's starting soon. Next time it'll be the real thing. I'd almost be angry, but he's kind of right. That that was pathetic. <laughs> pathetic. Now, is it actually open now? No, it's not. I cannot start the next competition yet. I'll have to complete another world or two. Uh, well, it was really hard to walk when I took the cord out of the television. Anyway, um, I'm Cross Nikes. Next episode, we will go to the new world. Which world will it be? That is a mystery even to me, but it's one of three. See you there.